So we're gonna have to consult with Marilyn about this one. Cause this next one is some bull. I was gonna go out to the car. I'm D, no wheel drive, 229 by the way. I was gonna go out to the car to show y'all, but I'm too depressed to even do that. I'm not that depressed, but it's just starting to get aggravating. Okay, this thing on, all right. So I gotta show y'all this. First of all, front view of the car. Ah, looking clean. Blacked out grill is killing it. All right, so. Turn that off before we get copyrighted. Yes, I like reggaeton. Look at that! YouTube. Look at this. The bad part about it is this has been on there for like a week. I just haven't had time to mention it in a video or do a video. I meant to mention it. I think I'm going to say this in the other part, but I meant to mention it in the part uh, the video where me and Calvin were at the car show. I meant to mention it. Look at this. Look at the miles. Last time I did it was like 34,000 and something. YouTube. What is the problem? This is not acceptable. Somebody fix this. Audi. It's not cool. Not cool? My car needs to be topped off. It's saying that the oil is low again. And I just topped it off, as you all know, like you all saw the video, not even hmm, maybe 600 miles ago on the car. So at, at this point, I'm starting to worry. I'm like, this can't be normal. But I don't, I never see anything leaking. Like I check under the car almost religiously now just to see nothing's leaking. So I don't really know what's going on, but this can't be normal. Like this is ridiculous. I just topped off the car and now it's saying I need to top off. And, and it's been saying that like, I didn't make the video on the day that it said it. Like it's been saying this for about four days now, but I just haven't got a chance to make a video. I meant to mention it on the video with me and Calvin were at the car show. That's when it first came back. And so I got in my car, I heard that chime, and I'm like, really? Really, you need to be topped off again? Not doing it. So I haven't topped it off yet because it's also time for the 35,000 mile service. As you all know, I wanted to get that service done and then tune it because you know, if everything checks out, then it'd be time to tune the car. Got to figure it's going to be good, you know, for at least another 50,000 miles. You know, I don't foresee any major issues below 75,000, even maybe 100,000. I don't know. Um, so I'm definitely going to have them check it out when they do that because that can't be, that can't be right, right? Yeah, so some of you guys who have S5s, definitely let me know if, you all have this problem. I haven't seen anybody else with it. <clears throat> I've talked to the dealer before and he said that it was normal. So, but it wasn't this often. Like at that point, it wasn't quite so often. But um, I mean, it may have something to do with how I drive because I usually drive in a lower gear than I should. Maybe fourth when I should be in fifth, fifth when I should be in sixth. But that shouldn't make it need this much oil. There has to be a leak, right? Or am I tripping? Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. Definitely y'all let me know. Especially y'all with S5s. I think Jar Jar S5. That, that dude always comments. He has one. Who else has an S5 that I remember commenting a lot? Some of y'all comment a lot. I know y'all have S5s. So let me know what you think that this could be. But if it were a leak, then I would see it on the ground, right? No? I guess it could maybe evaporate before it hits the ground or like the other engine parts are so hot but then I would smell it that's another thing right okay so if it was a leak and it was burning off then I would smell it right I don't know y'all work through this with me help me out cuz Adi said that it's okay but they're gonna check it out when I take it in for the service but this is making me a little nervous to tune cuz if this is like a major engine thing which I don't think it would be major but you know, you don't really want any shakiness with your car before you tune it. Because as we all know, that's going to be curtains for warranty. So, eh, I'm a little nervous. Even though the buddy has a hookup, so he said that, it, you know, if something happened to it, that he wouldn't hook it up to the system, whatever they, Audi computer thing, that they would know it's tuned. So, maybe I'll be good. I don't know. 
I don't know. I don't know. But it's quite aggravating. I'm not going to tune it out this time, though. I'm going to take it to them, make them top it off, and make them tell me, yo, what's up with the car? So, um, me and Marilyn. Me and Marilyn just been thinking about it. And uh, we're just going to make the video. Whatever. Y'all y'all know what it looks like. Y'all seen me top off the oil like 12 times. So, y'all have already seen that video. I was going to make a whole other thing. Me going to advance. You know, with the little music, the little freaking generic music you have to use on YouTube, the little do 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 do, and I'm driving to AutoZone, and I get the oil, and that dude, you know, people hear the car, they want to come outside, I put the oil in the car, I get in it, and I talk about me just putting the oil in the car, but I was like, eh, there's no reason to do all that. So, I'm just asking for you all's help. Comment below. Let me know what the problem is. I don't know. It's got to be something, right? It's got to be something. So... Um, we're gonna get this worked out. This is not gonna stop us from the Audi build. This is just one small step for mankind. Wait, how's that phrase go? Wait, I don't think that phrase fits at all. Is it one small step for mankind, one giant leap? Let's erase that. Taking that out of the video. Never mind. Just ignore all that. This is just a small problem. But uh, we gonna still tune the car. Basically, is the point. Just ignore the rest of that. So yeah, um, do you know we'll drive 229, my S5 people, or anyone who knows about Audis, A5, RS5 guys, anybody, Volkswagen group people, let me know what the problem is, because your boy is tired of topping off the oil every 500 miles. So uh, definitely let me know more videos to come. No wheel drive. Live good, y'all. Make some good decisions out there, man. Be safe out there. Um, enjoy your weekends. almost... You know, getting time for the summer, the perfect weather. I mean, the weather's been good in Georgia, but, you know, all my North people, the weather's getting good. It's summertime. Turn up, live good. The playoffs are on. Let me know that, too, by the way. Who y'all got in the playoffs? Is it definitely going to be Golden State? I know that has nothing to do with cars, but let me know who you got. I got Golden State. Um, What else y'all need to do? Besides liking, subscribing, and sharing, I can't think of anything else. So... Yeah, the Noah Drive 229. Y'all have a great day. Live good. Bye.